While people all over the UK took part in the festivities of Bonfire Night, some of the party seemed to be left behind. On Tuesday morning, the Swansea University Students' Union partnered with the Discovery Student Volunteering Swansea to remove the mess left behind on the Swansea Bay Beach. With broken bottles and shredded pieces of paper, student Evie German explains how the rubbish left behind can be dangerous. We think it's really important to keep the beaches clean because it's so close to the uni and also to get the students involved in um, just keeping the environment clean and we also use it and uh, there's been bonfire night now so we're trying to kind of keep it clean both for us and for the Swansea locals so yeah. So today it's a bit different because yesterday was bonfire night and there might be live fireworks and stuff like that which is important to get off in case someone uh, like dogs and children and people in general walking on the beach um, get yeah, encounters with them and it can be quite dangerous so it's uh, very important to get it off easily and then just keep the beach tidy and clean in general. Uh, it's normally plastics and people leave a lot of rubbish behind on the beach and yeah it's just the one beach we have and if we don't keep it tidy then yeah. I think it's important to show that students actually care about the environment and to show that we care about our Swansea Beach and we're so close to it in uni that if we wouldn't help them, who else would? And you know that other people might not have as much time on their hands as we do. Maintaining the beaches is not just a project that benefits some, but everyone who visits them every day. Project coordinator Sean Gillespie says that he enjoys making people happy by making sure that the beaches are clean. Uh, every four weeks we do beach cleans and it means a lot to me that people think we're doing a good job and um, making people happy that there's no rubbish on the, on the um, beach and making sure it's clean. Uh, I really like working in Discovery because they're always very nice and friendly and um, I re I been doing disco uh, the beach clean for eight, eight or nine years and I've been the longest serving volunteer in Discovery for nearly 12 years now. Because I like, like um, what I do and they're very, they're nice people and it's cool. While Discovery's main goal today is to get the local area back to its place, Student President of Discovery, Sophie Hawking, says that they want to help students get out there and help their community. Yeah, so um, I think the, the aim of Discovery is to kind of make the local area a better place um, and kind of help students get out into the local community. So doing beach cleans like this is really important because we have this beautiful beach right on our doorstep um, that everyone in Swansea you know, enjoys. Um, so being able to kind of contribute to maintaining it and making it look nice and so that everyone, everybody can enjoy it is really nice and after events like um, bonfire night um, it's just really nice to kind of make sure that everyone can enjoy the beach and everyone gets a chance to use it. It tends to be this idea that students make a lot of mess so I think it's really cool that we're out here today tidying up after everyone using the beach last night. It seems that every action counts when trying to keep Swansea Bay beaches clean. Nicole Lucius, That's TV.